Uh, yesterday in the afternoon, we went out in northern Longinia, and then I got a call from tour guide from Serena, uh, telling us there was uh, they'd been seeing a young female by herself in the morning, and when we went to the scene, we found Kitty, a female from KB's family. She just had a baby about five hours ago, and she's a non-experienced female because she's young. That is her first baby. And we stayed with her for a few hours. And then finally, she was planning to go and have a drink water in the river. And bad luck, the car fall in the water. And she didn't have an experience to take the baby out. The baby was so weak. That's why she could not get out of the water. And also the mother, she was trying all her best to dig. And she was, she was a bit confused what to do. It's so sad the family must be left her when she was having a baby because according to what I know the family, they're always all together. It was just bad luck. And when the, the baby fell in the, in the river, we had to call KWS to come and rescue and help us. KWS came, Kitty was so brave. They was trying to shoot shotgun for her to move away and she couldn't. She was trying like, all the time protecting our baby. Finally, we have to drive three vehicles and shoot the gunshot. And finally, she decided to move like five meters away. And then at the time, rangers went into the water and tried to grab the baby and take the baby out. And then when she came back and found her baby, she's out of the water. I don't want to think we can push Here we are in the morning with the baby. She didn't even move far away from where she put baby into the water. Uh, she's trying to keep on calling the family. We hope the family might come back. Right now, in the morning, she's trying to call the family and looking the direction uh, where the family normally head to, uh, communicating with them. And it is, it is be very good if she can get the family because for high chances of the baby to survive is slim because of the predators too. And if the family come back to her or join the family, the baby have high chances of her to survive. very sad again. We came back. We are here in the morning, around 7.30 in the morning. We found her about five meters away from where she put the baby in the water yesterday. Now, again, the baby, she's in the water and looking very weak. Uh, high chances again for her to survive is slim, 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 and drowning in the water again. Now we want to rescue again, calling people to come and help us again to take the baby out. Uh, Kitty, she's very, really a bit confused what to do. She's so stressed, she cannot even know what to do to try to get the baby out of the water by herself. Less experience, that's why she's digging, dusting herself because of confusion. We decided to call Kenya Wildlife Services and our neighbors, uh, Oltukai Lodge, and they came. And then you remove the calf again from the water and then you take the calf and away from the water about like two kilometers and a half 
where normally the KB's family is around there. And we managed to do that. And now, uh, and the female kitty finally came and followed the calf. She came because she heard the, the keep and communicating with the calf and finally she followed the calf. She came, she found the calf and then she was keep calling the family and we left her safe and we hope where she, the direction she was heading to where the family are, keep and calling, and we hope the calf will survive, the baby who might survive. The way I've been seeing the calf walking, very strong young male. <laughs>